Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Um, today is a little bit of an impromptu video. It's been a long time. Decided it'd be nice to do just a little Trader ha Hauls. Um, do a little bit of a Trader ha Trader Joe's haul. I think that makes sense. Hopefully it does. <laughs> a little bit of impromptu, but you know that was the first video I did. I started, so I figured I'd do it again. So I'm just going to show you a little bit of what we bought. Most of the stuff is from Trader Joe's. There are a few things on here where we go to a local uh, fruit and vegetable store because I just feel like the stuff lasts a little bit longer and it's better quality. But I'll show you when we get there. I'm going to start with what I have here. So most of the stuff is going to be fruits and vegetables. So I'm actually trying to do a bit more of meal prepping um, and just you know have a little bit of a healthier diet. But got some grapes here, some green grapes. So if you follow me on Instagram, you already know. I go through these really quickly. Today is day number one, but once they're washed and in the fridge, probably will only last, I'll say a day or two. But we got some green grapes. I also got some Go Macro bars. I just like keeping these on hand. Um, my favorite flavors are the maple one, and then there is the oatmeal chocolate bar. These two are my favorite. I just like keeping them on hand just in case even though i'm meal prepping i get a little hungry has a lot of protein in it um and it's really good and it's not free too and vegan so it's good also have some portobello mushrooms normally we get shiitake mushrooms just to add in food but i really like the meaty texture of the portobello mushrooms so we decided to just opt in for those this week probably gonna add them in like a stir fry with some vegetables um and have that but both Trin and i really just like throwing in some mushrooms here and there when we cook. Oh, and by the way, I have some Palo Santo in the background, just, you know, cleansing the air, making sure we're getting the day started on the right foot, even though it's 12.30, but you know, gotta do what we gotta do. Also got a bunch of spinach. This one isn't from Trader Joe's. It's from that local fruit and vegetable store we have up the street. We really like getting it here because, like, like, look how much is in here and it's 317 and it's really green it stays nice and fresh and again similar to mushrooms we add spinach to everything whether that's eggs whether that's just a little like leftovers and you get some greens in there smoothies we really like having this and that's what we get from the store we also got some broccoli i think there's actually two packs of these i want to use them for meal prep stir fry whatever um, just to have on hand, get my fruits and vegetables in. Um, I really like the green vegetables, they're my favorite. Also got some green beans in here, again, just adding them in the vegetables. Now please don't judge us, we have bags, I know, but the good thing is we reuse them. And yes, I know it's not the greatest, but we use them. The terrain cleans meat, we clean fish, we use the bags. I got some limes here, add them to water, also clean fish. Got some, I think these are plums. I don't eat these. I think terrain, terrain eats these. Plums or nectarines, one of those. That's what he likes. <laughs> also got a green pepper, yellow, orange pepper. Again, throw it in everything. Also, terrain sometimes makes seasoning with them. Got some avocados, as terrain would say, but avocados. Um, I'm gonna plan on making a salad during the week and just kind of like massaging it with the avocado to get some healthy fats in there. And then I have a bunch of Pink Lady apples. If you already know, Pink Lady apples are my favorite apples. Apple a day keeps the doctor away. Love having apples. And then I have a bunch of celery here. Again, please excuse the bag, it will get reused. Um, but I plan on trying to do the whole celery juice thing. I'll report back, let y'all know how it goes, but I have four like stalks of celery. Hopefully it's enough for one, each one's enough for one juice. Didn't get this from Trader Joe's, probably can tell it's not bagged. But um, yeah, plan on doing that. All right, we're gonna go over here. We're gonna transition a little bit. Also, yes, new kitchen, have moved. It's been a few months, lots of updates. <laughs> Got some eggs here, two package or two cartons of cage-free brown eggs. Um, gonna have them with breakfast, boil it, just have something super basic with oatmeal and all that. Also got some brown rice. I really wanna have, I really like rice, but I know that the white rice isn't always great, so I just bought the frozen ones because I heard it's really good. I haven't actually tried it before, but I've tried to cook brown rice and it's really hard. So we're just gonna go for this with my meal prep. 
got some cashew yogurt. We're not technically vegan, but we do try and do like primarily plant plant based or dairy free diet. And we do eat eggs, but these yogurts, if you haven't tried them at Trader Joe's, the one with the cashew in it, it's actually or the coconut cream is really good. These are trains, but the strawberry and the vanilla bean, they're really good. Got some vegan butter, you already know. Best one though, the Mykonos, 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 I think right, Greece. Mykonos. Regular butter for a train. Some carrots to snack on. I have some hummus left over in the fridge. Turkey bacon for a train, self explanatory. Got some bananas in here, pretty ripe because we still have some left over. And if not, if we don't use all of them, we just freeze them once they get kind of soft. As I mentioned, a bunch of meal prep. So this is just a whole bunch of salmon. Plan on cleaning it, cooking it, having it in the fridge ready for me to go so I can, you know, eat better. I think Terry just has some chicken thighs. Yeah, some chicken thighs here um, for his food. Then I'm gonna go through this bag down here. I already have taken some stuff out, but. Got some multi-green crackers. These are actually vegan. They're um, with sunflower and flax seeds. I haven't had these before. But I'm hoping that they're good. I like my crackers really crunchy, and so I'm hoping that these are good just to have something on hand. There goes that extra package of broccoli I was talking about. Some sourdough bread. Haven't bought this in a long time, but Terrain really wanted sourdough bread, so we got some of that this week. I'm like losing space on the counter here. Sun Gold Kiwi. These are the best kiwi. And I think it's a seasonal thing. So if you can find it now, you have to go get them because I feel like they're on the low supply. But these are so good compared to regular kiwi and they're sweet and sour at the same time. It's like Sour Patch Kid, Sour Sweet Gone. <laughs> also got some Boston butter lettuce um, to add to my salads with the spinach, all of that. Um, you know, a little Boston in the house, you know what I mean? I really don't know, if anybody knows this, why is it called Boston? Is it Boston butter lettuce or butter lettuce? Why? What does that have to do with Boston? Anybody knows? Old fashioned oats for the oatmeal I was talking about. I think we're running low, so I want to refresh on that. Some walnuts running along that, so just replenish. Really like putting this in um, oatmeal, um, especially fall. You put some pumpkin seeds, some of this, some um, hemp seeds, all of that. And apples, ooh, it's like apple cinnamon really good app, um, really good oatmeal and train also like snacking on these and then I got some red onion and I got some more tomatoes I really like these because they're just super easy to throw in food I do prefer like on the vine or like plum tomatoes Ooh, they're so good also the season for them but these are just really easy to add to food and salads and I think that's about I think that's about it. I think that's all the food we got. Um, this is kind of just like a quick little haul of things that we got. Like I said, trying to meal prep. I'm also going out of town at the end of the week, so didn't want to go too overboard. But um, you know, hopefully I can make some more of these videos. If you like it, stay tuned, like, subscribe, comment, tell me some things that you like getting at Trader Joe's that you should that you think I should try out. And again, love you all. Thanks for being here.